going to tell me it was for my own good, right? No, it was for mine. It was for mine, Gail. It was for my own good. Gail, I was doing 30 years. What was I supposed to do? I knew you were going to try and wait for me. You were going to visit me. You were going to make me think about you all the time. Now, what, what was I supposed to do? So this was his girl before he got locked up, I'm just assuming. You know, just because I remember him telling the story when he was in that club. So I just got to make that clear for people. If I just in case I might have cut that clip out. And all you got to do is be there with the boat to pick me up. Look, Tony, this is not exactly the Listen, case. the contract's already down on your pal. The guys, the guns, the line pit's already done. You understand what I'm saying? And hey, Carlito. Yeah, in the office. Yeah. Hey, you want to see him? You told me he was doing 30 years. Yeah, well, I guess he got out, you know? The one from the Bahamas, you know? You know, the La Rubia, the one that looks like my sister, you know? That's Gail. Yeah, I seen, seen her down in, 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 the sh in the show, down on 40 and Broadway. When was it? She, uh, two weeks ago, man. Uh, Pachanga told me he was doing 30 years. Yeah, beat it. Beat it. How'd you do that? Uh, you know, like you, I did a lot of reading. And uh, I worked with some guys, some smart guys in a joint, and just beat it. So. Whoo! He wired up. Wow, this man had a wiretap just under his friggin' suit. Man, there ain't no loyalty in the game, man. They were at when I was reacting to Goodfellas and someone left a comment. He was pretty much saying, man, there's no loyalty in the drug game. There's no loyalty with any of this shit. Like, it is what it is. They'll, they'll rat all y'all out when it comes down to this money. It is what it is, man. Who it was? All I know is he sent somebody out to talk to me wearing a wire. Oh, that's a bitch. He's been laying on me, too. Another shit. Yeah, well, I ain't dealing. I ain't going back to prison, no matter what! Damn! Oh, I'm leaving all this in the, my, on my video. All of it. Yo, ho, 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 yo, she kinda bad. Just saying, I know y'all probably won't know the name of this girl, but if you do, let me know in the comment section below. She fire. She straight fire. I like the afro, too. That afro's booming. Wasn't that his girl at one point? Listen, 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 listen. If, if you had feelings for a girl and you was feeling a girl and you found out she was a stripper, would you still talk to her? I mean, I'm, I'm going to be real. Like, I, I'd have to get my feelings out at that point because, like, if you a whole-blown stripper, like, that that's a problem, man. If you a stripper, OnlyFans, porn, any of that, like, it, it it's, it's raps, bro. It's raps. It's raps. Sorry, it's raps. Not that there's anything wrong with this. I'm not saying that. Wait a second, Charlie. I work hard here. You know, I dance. I get well paid for it. I don't fuck anybody. Oh, oh, hey, yeah. I didn't say that. Um, Please. um, <laughs> that's all alleged. That's all alleged. You know, I. that's all, that's, you got to take her word. That's all alleged. Okay, just saying. Because me, anyone with half a brain already knows that all strippers are hoes, bruh. It is what it is. I know there's going to be some people that feel some type of way. It is what it is, man. You're sitting there judging me. Oh, come on, Gail. I'm not judging you. Please, don't say that. I mean, That's not true. I don't judge you, you know, Charlie. Now, what do you do that's so wonderful, huh? You ever kill anybody, Charlie? Fucking understanding. Yeah, I don't know, man. Maybe you don't remember me. My name is Maybe Benny. I don't give a shit. Maybe I don't remember the last time I blew my nose either. Who the fuck are you? I should remember you. Huh? What, you think you like me? You ain't like me, motherfucker. You a punk. Oh, I've been with many people. Be over, man. You fucking in the history books. That's what you are, man. So you might as well fucking kill me now, because if I ever see you again, I swear to God, I'm going to fucking kill you. Ah, ah! Damn. Oh. Yo, I'll 
Pacino in this kind of looks like DJ Khaled just a little bit. Like, I'm not saying he looks a lot like him, but, like, I can definitely see the resemblance. You know what I'm saying? If they ever, like, remake this, you know, DJ Khaled might have to play a part in it, like his younger brother or some shit. I need you to do something for me. Okay, what is it? You gotta help me spring Tony Tagliolucci from the prison barge at Rikers. Rikers Island. Son's gonna call me. Are you in? Yeah, I'm in. All right, I'm in. Okay. Well, uh, can I come in? I bought you some cheesecake. I don't like cheesecake. <laughs> Every. I mean, you know, I'm not, I'm not trying to like, you know, diss in any way, but I mean, if you a whole stripper and a whole hoe, I mean, you don't really have any, uh, you know, credibility to call him fucking crazy or call him a cokehead. Yeah, I mean, you a stripper, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, like, I mean, we, we, I, 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 listen, I'm even, bro. I'm even. You know what I'm saying? But like, if you a whole hoe, yeah, I mean, you don't really have any credibility to say anything. Just, just saying, like, you a whole stripper and a hoe. So I mean. You know why? Should, why should anyone hang out with your ass? Like, you know what I'm saying? Not, not trying to be rude. I'm just being real. Like, I, you, you got to be balanced. You know what I'm saying? Came the big night right away. I didn't like it. Kleinfeld was coked out of his mind. The flaps of his nose all red and swollen. <laughs> Bad start, Jack. Yeah, he a cokehead, man. Help me! Help me! Help me! Help me! Help! You tell me how it feels! The fucking... Damn! Damn! Oh! Yeah, he dead, man. You get him on the boat, only to kill him? Huh? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That was unnecessary. You should... I don't know. This, this man literally went out way out into the ocean only to kill this dude. Come on, man. You ripped him off, didn't you? Who? Tony T. You did take the million dollars, didn't you? Yeah. So, you stole a million dollars from this dude, and then you said you was going to rescue him, you brought him out to the ocean, and then killed him. What type of snake sh Man. Man. Damn! Oh! Oh! This is a Luchi sister. Hold that for That's what happens when you be snaking people, man. After he got out of prison, he started coming up to my office and making a lot of telephone calls. I got suspicious. I found out he was back with Rolando Rivas, his old partner. Young Coke. And I'm talking serious numbers. Would you testify to that? Absolutely. Damn. That dude he was working with. So first, this dude snaked that dude. He was supposed to escape out of jail. Damn. Damn. That that olive dude or whatever his name is. That all I don't know what his name is, but I don't I don't even want to know the dude's name. That dude a rat, man. That dude is ratting. Him and Six Nine will fuck around and be best friends though. I tell you that. Listen, I'm gonna go to the club, get my money, and walk straight to Grand Central. Train leaves 11:30 for Miami. You gonna be there, Gail? You gonna be there? I love you. I love you. It's your pal. Ah, scared the hell out of me. Goddamn cops not supposed to let anybody in. I mean, it's you, but it's okay. Save your own ass. Save your own ass. See this? Mm -hmm. Belongs here. Mm -hmm. Not behind the pillow. Mm -hmm. This way you can reach for it quick. Mm -hmm. They come in, you ready for them. From who? From my father and my brother. 
Oh. Adios, counselor. Woo. Oh. Damn. Yo, my man emptied the bullets and threw them in the garbage. Yo, that was a sick scene, man. That was a sick scene. I don't know who the director of this movie was, but that was sick. Because now you're dead. You got a bullet to the head. Damn. Maybe he's watching me. Seeing if I break. Waiting for me to panic. They still don't know for sure if I was on that boat. They think, but they don't know. Because if they knew, I'd already be dead. Woo! Oh, snap. Yo, this dude's slick with it, man. Oh. He was about to use that gun, boy. Get on that train, man. It's gonna be okay. Hey, remember me? Oh, snap. Benny Blanco from the Bronx. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh. La Yo, bro. My man was this close to getting on that train, man. Oh, my God. Jesus. That's crazy. That if he dies, that's crazy, which he more than likely is. My dude, Benny from the Bronx. You know how I feel, Scarlito. But I gotta think about my future, too. Damn. You know, peace that way sometimes, Papish. Come on, let's go. Nah, you stay here. Damn. Damn. Listen, me personally, I was feeling this more than Goodfellas. You know, Goodfellas was cool, but like just, I think this was a more balanced movie. You know what I'm saying? This was more balanced. It showed like the good, the bad, 
you know, the woman as well. That, that This was dope. This was dope. I like the women in this scene. Like, that strip club scene was fire. I'm, I'm going to leave that in, too. I'm going to leave that in. Listen, if you guys got any other videos you guys want to request, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. Sign up for my Patreon if you guys want me to check out any other exclusive videos that I won't be posting on my channel. And, um... Yeah, man, I, bro, this dude's down. Listen, Benny Blanco from the Bronx at the end, that shocked me. I was not expecting that. That whole twist at the end, that was crazy. But the characters were dope, though. You know what I'm saying? I like that one light-skinned girl with curly hair. She was fire, but this just goes to show there ain't no loyalty in the game, man. There ain't no loyalty in the game. You know what I'm saying? All these dudes, they gonna rat you out eventually. But um, other than that, man, I'm gonna be out of this thing. Holla. Um, so the first 30 minutes of this footage is gone because like my laptop, it, long story short, the first 30 minutes, <laughs> uh, my apologies for there not being an intro, but the first 30 minutes of this video is gone for some reason, I guess it didn't upload to my computer or whatever. Either way, I'm just going to paraphrase what happened in the first 30 minutes. So pretty much this movie is about this dude that got convicted of going to jail for 30 years. And then he had a crackhead lawyer that only gave him five years and then he ended up getting released. So now he's back in the streets and, you know, I think he um, owns part of this one club or whatever. And um, that's pretty much where it left off. So that's like just a quick little summary of what happened so far. But uh, enjoy the rest of the video, man. I'm going to go to sleep. I've been editing videos for the past 40 hours. Hit the like button, okay? I'm tired of shit.